Welcome to Draw Tip Tuesday. Today I'm going to show you a little trick. For which we don't need just one pencil but two. Also, we'll need two rubber bands, an eraser, a fine liner, a white color pencil, and an extra pencil for later. I'm going to use an old piece of cardboard because I like recycling and I like it as a background for my drawing. Let's start with the two pencils and wrap the rubber band around them. Tighten it and make sure the tips of the pencils are aligned. To secure it all, tighten them at the bottom with the second rubber band. This is your little construction for today. Put equal pressure on both pencil tips and make a curly shape. Already you can see the effect. All you need to do is close the gaps by connecting the lines. And this way, this really becomes a ribbon shape. With a fine liner, we're gonna trace the outlines. Leave out the lines that you don't need. Take a close look before you do so, to make sure your overlapping spaces are right. Unless, of course, you want a confusing perspective drawing, Escher style, which could be a fantastic challenge to do on purpose, by the way. Next, erase the pencil lines and then add white pencil. Think about where you want your light to be from in this drawing, so you know where shadow should be and where to put highlights. This will help you add depth and shape to your ribbon. Use a pencil to add shadows. This, by the way, is an HB pencil. Use light hatching strokes to add shadow. The more shadows you add, the more depth you create. Don't press too hard on your pencil. If you want it to be darker, Add another layer rather than pushing the pencil tip into the cardboard. Just a few finishing touches wherever you think is needed and you're done. Thank you for watching this video. You know you can make awesome art. Have a look at my website to join one of my classes today.